ready for it, but like, how did it feel in the moment of, of just seeing all your dreams come true? Do I was like, damn, do I leave home, just leave all this behind, or do I go to college? Why be in the mirror had to make a tough decision as a teenager, as a, uh, an older kid, he had to make a tough decision. And the decision was to, what was his, what was his next move, you know? Having so much fame in a small town or in a town where you have haters, you know? You have so many people that's looking at you and, you know, you could easily, something easily can happen to you and you don't even really know why it happened, you know? Growing up in poverty in all them environments, it's never a good idea to stay when you got money and you got bread and you popular and you got everything going for you, you know, because it's never a, a good out solution for that. It's always something to go wrong because somebody mad because you got something or you got more than what somebody else have, you know, it's so much stuff that goes on in, in those situations for real. Crazy thing about it is, I think he made a, a great decision, you know, obviously. Um, he speak about like his album and stuff and how, and, like why it's taking him so long, but we gonna get into that. But I just feel like it was a crazy uh, time period and interesting to look back on and see like his transitioning from a regular kid, you know, playing GTA every day to actually making boss moves and creating YBN movement that later helped YBN Corday or Corday and helped Almighty J into, you know, becoming millionaires and helping their family out. Like, that was a real boss move, you know? If, if YBN and Amir would have never signed he would have never been able to make money, as much money, to move his whole family out of Alabama. But if he would have stayed and then created the label, created, created his own label on some uh, Yo Gotti, Young Dolph type of issue and signed YBN Cordae and signed Almighty J, now nah, he would have been making some bread, bread. You feel me? Because all of the stuff that they got going would have been like him a part. You know, he would have been an executive too. So he wouldn't even have to drop an album at all. But that's crazy to see.